Zipped all the way? Uh, yeah. That's it's 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 go. Where it's are they? <gasps> What's going on? Oh my god! They goodness. won't hurt you. Look, they're just little insects. Oh, Can I? Once I had 25 at a time. Really? 25 what? Mm. <laughs> Good morning, it's Tuesday. We just got to school. We're running a little late this morning. Um, not late late, but just later than we wanna be. And I wanted to show y'all my board. Today I'm doing Truthful Tuesday. Tell Miss Edwards something about you that she doesn't already know. And Paisley is putting out sticky notes on their desk so that they can write something down and stick it on the board when they come in this morning. She don't wanna do this? I don't think she had time yet. Oh. You like Paisley's hair? <laughs> I French braided it last night, and now it's all wavy and cute. Those are getting big. I think they started eating each other. The praying mantises? Mm -hmm. Let's check on them. And they look like a lot fewer praying mantises. There they are. See, that's like a lot fewer of praying mantises and they're getting really big. One was like <laughs> See that one? Oh, it's moving. You're it's like they're dead. I think they're just tired. Maybe they're sleeping. sleeping. So, I am going to unpack and Paisley's gonna go get some breakfast. My kids should be here in about five or less minutes. And we just have a regular day today. I don't think we have anything that exciting. But I will check back in with you guys in a little while. And I hope you guys have a good day today. Peace. I don't know what's with the peace. <laughs> I love you. I have to say, my kids were so good this morning so quiet during our rotations. They were so quiet. I had two kids at two separate times come up to me and say, it's really quiet in here. And I said, yeah, I know, I like it, don't you? And they're like, yeah. So um, that helped me because I got some testing done this morning. I still have four kids that I'm working on and I have the rest of this week and Monday. So I'm feeling pretty good about it. And my kids are at lunch now. I am gonna start a lesson or a unit on maps when they get back. So we're gonna talk about what they know about maps, what they wanna know about maps, and then we're gonna do like a sorting activity. So I have some words on cards like this. And then I have uh, cards that have the directions, or not the directions, the definitions. So they're gonna find the word and the definitions that that match. So we're just gonna do that as kind of like an introduction to maps. And right before lunch, I read two more chapters in our book, and I'll have one more chapter to read this afternoon, and then we'll do their novel study at the end of the day for our extra 20 minutes. So I'm gonna go eat a bite. We have some leftover Olive Garden from yesterday, so that'll be nice to enjoy. And I also need to have a couple of second opinions on some written responses for our testing, just because I'm not really sure. So I'm gonna go do that, and I'll see you guys soon. through homework folders and wonder what in the world happened where in the world has their homework folder been to get this dirty or gross look at this homework folder what even is that I don't even know why I just touched it it looks like crumbs of some sort 
but it's like all in there. It's on the front. That's just gross. And look at this. I don't know where her reading log has been, but it is disgusting. I don't know why. What is that? And that, I just don't know where these homework folders have been. And I just don't know. I don't know why they're so dirty. They must just get home and toss them in the yard somewhere until the next day. I don't know. Anyways, my kids are in the library right now. When they get back, we have our fifth math assessment of the month. And we got our spring pictures back today. And so we actually sent home some pictures about a month ago that are like journey pictures. They have like, if they've been at this school, kindergarten first and second, then they're like all on one sheet. And we send those home. If they don't want them, they can return them. If they do, they can return the money or if they just want to buy some of the pictures and send some of the pictures back, that's fine too. Well, then we had spring pictures made. If they have brought back their journey pictures, then they can have their spring pictures. But if they haven't, then I have to hold on to them until they send the other ones back. So I only had like two, four, six, eight, 11 kids who are actually gonna get to take home their spring pictures today because they either brought theirs back or brought the money back. So that's what I did. And then also my class has earned 20 blue paws for their specials classes. So on Friday of this week, I am letting them bring a reward item to school as a reward. So they get to choose what they wanna bring. They can bring any kind of toy from home that can bring Legos or a stuffed animal or Barbies or cards or a video game or an iPad or anything that they want to bring to school. And I give them 30 minutes during the day to have that celebration time. And so I'm sending a note home with my students today to let their parents know they can bring something on this Friday. Next week, we are gonna be swimming. Uh, second graders go to the YMCA for an hour of swim lessons four days next week. It's a really fun trip and we take the second graders every year. So that'll be exciting. And I still have several kids who haven't paid. So I have to send notes home with them today. So I'm gonna work on typing up the note, getting that in their folders and look over my plans for today. So yeah, just make sure I'm ready for math. But I'm gonna go and work on this letter and I will see you guys probably after school. Okay. Will it hurt our plants? No, they're good for plants. They eat all the bad bugs. Oh, okay. good. Look at him. Oh, he's dead. <gasps> no! One of the plant mantises died. No, there's more of them. I saw them. One of them died. I'm so sad. Bye bye. Here, I'll lift up the top. Wow, well, it doesn't lift up very well. Oh, egg. Egg. Sprinkle them all around. Oh, I see Oh my goodness. They don't want to come out. I know. Because they're dead. No, they're not. Look. Here. You're scared because so many people are in front. Can you, is it unzipped all the way? Uh, yeah. That's it's Where are they? <gasps> What's going on? Oh they goodness. won't hurt you, look. They're just little insects. Oh, no, Can I feel it? Oh, they're so cute. Oh, get it on my finger now. I'll a picture of a primary. Okay, got it. On I'm gonna push it on my finger. Do you want to get one? Yeah. Cool. I want to put one on my finger. Look at all of them in there. Can I put oh, one on my finger? Yeah, just be gentle. Yeah, y'all can put your finger. They'll just hold your finger out and they'll get on your finger. Because and I you can look up, up close at it and you can see there's six Xavier. legs. Come here. Yeah. We're oh. letting out our prey mantis. Aww. Does it tickle? Just yeah. don't hurt him. Not really. They won't hurt you. It's cute. My See, there's one right there. Terrified. Well, oh, the little so baby small. ones. That one. 
are cute, but the big ones they do kind of like look kind of terrifying. Yeah, they look so the babies look, aren't they cute? The adults look cute. And see their little praying hands. It's Pickles. Come here. Kind of out, everybody. I don't know how we're gonna get them out. Maybe everybody why, is there so, why is there so many? Well, the egg holds a bunch of them. I already had one. No, I got one. Is you want it? Let me take the pineantus off. Yeah, don't smush it. Dad, you hold it. Doesn't want to. Dude, like standing on the tip of his finger, doing like this. Here. If you just hold it and watch them, they do. They look funny. They move up around front. Look. You just have to like. Uh, I got one. I got one. I guess Hay reminds him too. How are they going to come out? Yeah, like, I don't know. Mm. Oh, nine. Nine isn't right. This is. Try 16 again. Get out 16 cubes and make pairs. Eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. Stop. Now count. Count your pairs. Yes. Good. Okay, we're ready to do the bag. You have 12 and 16. Look. It can't both be 6. 6 plus 6 is 12. That would work for this one, but what about 16? Can I check yours? Ooh. Can we look at this one again? The yes is right, but the number, let's check. So get let's get 12. Let's get 12 cubes. Yeah, one second. Twelve. Okay. Now make partners. So there's a pair, 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 pair. Okay, now count your pairs. See, you were so close. Good job. Well, I made it through Tuesday. I just got back to the room and I was cleaning up and erasing my board and I realized I didn't show you guys what my kids wrote on sticky notes this morning. So on the board this morning it said, think thoughtful, no, what did it say? <laughs> I forgot what it said. Thoughtful Tuesday? I don't remember. Anyways, so my kids were supposed to write down something on a sticky note that they felt that I didn't already know about them. So here are some of the responses. So, Miss Edwards does not know I have an annoying brother and I will get a pool and I have a trampoline. That is all she does not know. Miss Engel taught my daddy Somebody taught her dad at this school, I bet. Once at cheer practice, I was dehydrated and I passed out. <laughs> I have, I don't know what that is. Problems, maybe? I don't know. I like Nerf gun, tank. I was singing songs on something, Monday, maybe. My mom was born in Ukraine. <laughs> My dog was a stray. Did you know I can cartwheel with one hand and two feet? Miss Edwards does not know that next weekend I something camping two weeks after that, and we are going to the beach. Well, these are stuck together. 
and my something is going with me, my dad, Hunter, Memo, maybe my something. <laughs> Once I had 25 at a time. Really? 25 what? Once I had six pets at a time. Oh, she probably wrote what she wrote. Xavier and Fabian have the same name, but are first and name is different. And I like Nerf ones. I said that already. For our book study tomorrow, I am going to give my students these bubble maps that have different characters names on them and the way that I printed them there were two on a page like this and so I printed them and cut them out and I wanted to put them in order like the characters in the order that they appear in the book and so I'm having to go through each one and sort and put them in order because they're not in order so like Edward and then Abilene and then the fisherman, and then the fisherman's wife, and then Lolly, which is their daughter, and then, oh, I forgot Pellegrina. So we've got Pellegrina, and then all those people, and then Bull, and then Lucy, the little boy, and the little boy's sister, and then staple them together. So that's taking me like 20 minutes to do. So I'm going to staple them like this, and then they'll have them all there as we go through the book. I printed some more of the setting the story stage so that they can draw the setting from a new chapter and chapter summary. This is something that I made copies of today for our social studies. We started talking about maps, and I told my students to write down, let's see, oh, they're right here. So I had my students write down somewhere. So I gave them this inqu inquiry flip book or inquiry flip book, I guess. And it says glue onto a notebook page, write down what you know and what you want to know about maps under each flap. So this was kind of just an introductory about maps. So he said they help you get to place, they help you find your way. And then what I want to know about maps, how who made the first map, how are maps made. So we just did that as kind of an introductory. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna give them a set of cards. I already have them copied and cut. And they're going to match the card to the definition. I wanted to do that today, but I just didn't have time. So I'm gonna finish getting these together. Paisley got her spring pictures back today. Doesn't she look beautiful? I don't know if I'm going to get them or not, but she's growing up so fast. I just got done creating my two new learning targets for maps since we are starting maps and put those up. I've straightened up a little bit and now I need to head out because it is a quarter till five and Paisley has gymnastics at 520. So I feel pretty good. I went through and graded some papers and made some copies of some things and I'm all ready for tomorrow. So thank you guys so much for watching today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to click on the thumbs up button down below to let me know that you liked it if you did. Subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos from me and I hope you all have a wonderful evening and I will see you guys tomorrow.